Uh, my name is Nick Cheng. I'm a doctoral candidate in Philip Powadol's lab at the Ontario Institute for Cancer Research. I've always been interested in genetics, um, particularly how genetics not only shapes us, but how we respond to the environment as we age. Um, but I really wanted to do interests that can be potentially applied to the clinic or have some kind of real life utility. I think that really steered me towards cancer naturally. Um, so right now I'm working on identifying biomarkers for early cancer detection. Um, specifically, I'm profiling blood samples collected several years before someone is even diagnosed with cancer. And the idea here is to look for specific markers that are specific to a particular cancer type um, that can not only tell us whether or not someone has cancer, but also where the cancer is located. Uh, but what makes our, our my research slightly different is that we're looking at these blood samples collected up to seven years before someone gets typically diagnosed with a cancer. So we're really looking at these blood samples in asymptomatic individuals so that we could potentially apply blood tests for early cancer detection. Across most cancers, there aren't really any recommended uh, screening guidelines. Uh, right now, only four different cancer types are routinely screened for. So what we could potentially do with these early cancer detection tests is not only detect um, cancers that aren't routinely screened for, but also detect them at a stage where they're highly treatable and survival rates are significantly higher. I think my hopes for this work at the moment as a PhD student is that it'll bring us one step closer to bringing these blood tests into, um, into some kind of routine screening program or just, just as part of regular screening, health screenings uh, for individuals. I think we're still, there's still quite a few more steps before we get there. And of course, there's a lot of interest in the field, not just at OICR, but um, globally as well. I'm trying to graduate by next year. Uh, I'm still trying to figure out what direction I want to take my research next. You know, I've done a lot uh, in this early cancer detection space, but obviously there is, you know, a lot to do in the cancer uh, in the cancer space. Um, I think there's some things I'm particularly interested in are potentially um, looking at researching the role between the microbiome and cancer risk. Uh, 